Okay, we're here at the DigiDesign booth with John Connolly, and uh, John is one of the members of Tech Breakfast, and we're going to have him talk about the C24. So basically, you may be familiar with the Control 24, the predecessor to the C24. What we did is we took all the good stuff of the Control 24 and included it, and then all the negative feedback from the Control 24, we addressed those issues. The high profile, we re reduced that. We bumped up the quality of the mic pre's. We greatly improved the monitor section. It's 5.1 or stereo capable. We improved the, the line submixer as well, so you can route it into your monitor section, as well as add a master fader. It's 24 faders, touch sensitive, motorized, and also we improved the scribble strips. I don't know if you recall on the old Control 24, we had four character scribble strips, no longer the case, greatly improved. So overall, we've improved the ergonomics of it, the profile of it, the sound quality of it, and how you navigate through your Pro Tools session, for instance, adding plugins. So that's kind of the, the 30 second overview of, of C24. Anything else new in the show we should know about? Pro Tools 7.4 which we've been, you know, shipping for a couple months. So that might not be a real brand new thing, but... Strike. And Strike, yeah. There's an add-on to Strike, the uh, virtual instrument from our air division. New sounds. You'll dig that. 